guys. Um, so today I am going to be telling you how to get your hands to be really soft. And this doesn't just have to be your hands. It can be your feet, your legs, your arms, your face even, if you have the proper face lotion. So let's get started. The first thing is this lotion. Don't know what it's called. I don't. I know where it came from. Um, I got it. They were giving them away free with every manicure and pedicure at the nail salon. And it just, it looks like a sauce or something. And it just squirts out like that. And um, you don't need a lot, but I've been putting this on my hands and um, feet for since like yesterday I think I don't know and I'm already starting to notice a difference so there must be something in here you know that's pretty good but yeah I like it I don't know what it's called but if I find out you know the ingredients I'll definitely update you guys the next thing is use a lathering body wash this is from Bath and Body Works it's in white citrus if you take bubble baths just pop the cap and then when as the water's running, just pour it a little bit out um, under the water and it'll give you a nice foaming bubble bath. If you want to take a shower, squirt some out on a sponge or loofah and just wash your body. And um, I've started to notice some softness and I got this yesterday too. Um, it was $12.50 at Bath and Body Works, but it was on sale. So I got it for about $8. Um, comes with a lot of product. It's white citrus. I think I already said that. But yeah. Um, the next thing is use lotion night and morning. My night lotion is Moonlight Path. Um, oh, I just this is just a nighttime scent for me. I don't know why I love it so much, but it definitely is not something I'd use in the daytime. It just yeah, and it's purple. Purple reminds me of nighttime, so why now? The one that I use in the morning is not over there. That sucks. Um, do I have a voicemail? Hold on, y'all. Okay, I got a text message. Let's see who it is. I don't think I'm doing anything. Okay, so, um, I use Country Chick by Bath & Body Works. Oh, this is by Bath & Body Works, too, by the way. Um, it is from their signature collection. I can't really describe... My hands are shaking. I can't describe the smell. It smells like... It smells very... Kind of very sugary, but not too sugary. I don't know how to describe it. The next thing is use a very good hand soap. My hand soap, of course, is in my bathroom. The only place that I use my hand soap is in the bathroom. And um, I'm not going to go get it, but yeah, it's in there and it's fresh pear. It's fresh picked pear and I like it a lot. And it's very softening, and it was five fifty at Bath and Body Works, or five for fifteen, or seven for twenty. I thought that was really good. My phone is being retarded. Okay, the next thing is if you're gonna use a hand sanitizer, use one that's very moisturizing. Um, nothing with, um, a lot of alcohol in it, like that right there. That is isoprile alcohol, or as many people commonly know it, rubbing alcohol. That is very, very bad to put on your hands, or get on any part of your body. Let me go see what's up something. Oh, Jesus, people, get off your stupid motorcycles. Some gay person is on a motorcycle. Okay. What is Chastity saying? <laughs> All 
Alright, so, where was I? Oh, yeah. That stuff. Don't put it on your hands. Don't put it on your body. It will dry your skin like you're drying a hide in the sun. It is terrible. It is good for certain things, but for other things, it's not. So don't put it on your skin because it's very drying. Come on. Mm. Powerade is my best friend. I'm sorry, guys. My phone is just buzzing away. And that's pretty much all I have to say as far as keeping your skin really clean and nice and soft. And I'm going to put everything back in my bag and sip it. Oh, my iPad. It's about to die. All right. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.